everyone, Mrs. Taylor here. I'm just here to show you a really quick video about how to use your virtual thinking tracks on your assignment today. So as you can see, I am on my Google Classroom and this is what it looks like for you guys. So I'm just gonna click on the assignment and I am going to click on this document over here. Now, once I click on this, it is going to bring up my thinking tracks. So today's assignment is somebody wanted but so. All you have to do is click in each of these boxes and type your responses. And you guys will see that it will type in right there. So you're gonna fill in all four of these boxes and make sure you do that. And then you're gonna turn in your assignment. Now, this is a little tricky because I know up here in the corner, it doesn't have a turn in button. But if you go back to your original page where your assignment is at, you guys will see this button right here. It says turn in. Make sure that you turn in your assignment because then it won't show up as missing on your side and then we can make sure that you're doing your work too. So make sure that you turn it in. But all you have to fill out on these thinking tracks is your assignment for each day. Now, one thing that we were a little bit worried about is that you might accidentally delete the text box. Um, so I wanted to show you really quick how to make a new one just in case that happened to you. So for example, if I'm clicked right here and I just accidentally delete the whole thing, now you'll notice that I can't type there. So there's two ways to fix it. One way is that you can go to insert and you can click text box and you can just go ahead and draw yourself a new text box right there. And you can go ahead and type in there again. And um, the other way to fix it, if I just delete it again, um, I can go over here and I can right click and I can actually just copy this, copy my text box, and I can paste it. And you guys will see it just showed up right there. And I can just move it back over to the correct box. So you can do that with any of the boxes if you accidentally delete them. So it's totally fine. But we wanted to show you how to create a new text box just in case that happened to you. All right, guys, that's all you need to know about thinking tracks. Make sure that you turn them in when you finish. And yeah, happy reading. See you later.